Hey everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to reload your ATG gun. I've been asked several times on how to do this, and I thought it would just be easier to film a video showing it instead of explaining it. And um, I've also seen where people say it takes them like a few hours just to load it, and at first it takes a little bit, it shouldn't take three hours, but um, once you get the hang of it, it's actually really easy to do. One of the harder parts is actually opening this up because sometimes it can be a little tricky. There's these arrows right here and you just push in and then pull up on it. So then that opens your ATG gun for you to put the tape in. So first you want to take this and the arrows stay open so you just twist it and then pull it up and you just set that aside. And then your adhesive, it comes in acid free or just the general purpose. I like to use the acid free um, since I use it for scrapbooking, but I actually have one of each. I have two H ATG guns, um, one that has just acid free and one that's got general purpose. Um, if you're like making cards and stuff, you can probably get, a bu get by using just the general purpose. Okay, so here is your tape, and you want to take it, and this, you can see the little tab. You want it to go this way, so you want it to be under and facing this way, and you just slide it on, and then it clicks right into place. And then you want to go over the first one and under the second one. So you got to take this so that it can roll out and you just put it under and over and then you keep pulling it until it can reach this part over here so and actually if you do it you can see where it has like the um, tape on top I like to do it so that it, the adhesive starts right there so you can just pull it and put the adhesive so that it starts right there it's quite a bit um, of extra but that is what you want. So then I take it and I pull it firmly and then I adhere it down on top right there so then it stays right in place since it um, sticks to that. So that's exactly where you want it to be. And then down here there's this part that has two notches cut out of it. So you want to take it and set it through the first one and then through the second one so that it stays on there. And then you just wrap it around, and there's this little section that's got adhesive on it right there. You can take that and stick it right to there, so then it won't move on you. So that is that part. And then you can take your cover, and you just find on here where it slides right back in, and then you push the opposite way for it to close. And then you can close the cover until it clicks, and then that is how to load your ATG gun. Now, to start, when it starts, I just like to peel it a little bit so that it's not sticking to that part, and it's all ready to go. So hopefully that helped um, just the steps that I took to explain it. Um, if you do have any more questions on how to load them, just feel free to ask. But thank you so much for watching. Bye!